ang karunungan ay kapangyarihan. It's time once again to put that power to the test here on K-Check! Hello everyone! I'm Jules Giang with another season of Teaching and Learning here on K-Check. Patuloy pa rin ang paghahanap natin ng mga gustong sanayin at palawakin ang brain power nila through competition. Alamin natin kung kaya nila ang brain workout na inihanda natin for them this season. Samahan nyo kami until the final week of competition which will reveal our newest K-Check champion. Ang apat nating daily winners ang dadaan sa ating karunungan check sa araw na ito. Gab is a fourth year student taking up BS Social Work in UP Diliman. This active, competitive debater spends his free time either sleeping or binge-watching Western sitcom. Allen is a Bachelor of Education Study student at the UP Open University. He is also working part-time, is an online tutor, and is a fan of Miss Universe. Kim is a student of BA Philippine Studies from UP Diliman. He likes to sing classic OPM songs and is passionate about teaching the Filipino language to young people. And lastly, Seb is an active student leader in a third year BSECE student at TUP Manila. He's an animal lover, enjoys watching anime, playing online games, and listening to music. Seb is also passionate about learning new things and is a motorcycle enthusiast. These four will be competing under the watchful eyes of today's K-Check panel of experts. Professor Marian Roque, Professor of Mathematics at UP Diliman. Professor Neil Santillan, former chairperson of the UP Diliman Department of History. And a multimedia artist and Professor Emeritus, who teaches film at the UP College of Mass Communication Film Institute and Communication at the UP Open University, Professor Grace Javier Alfonso. At ngayon, contestants, good luck as we go into our first round. Get ready to buzz in, but wait till you're acknowledged before you answer para di sayang ang effort. Each correct answer is worth 10 points. Let's begin. This is round one. Question number one. In what European city can you find the Kremlin and Red Square? Gab. Germany. Germany is... Malay. Malay. Moscow. Moscow is correct. Okay, check. Question number two. What do you call the wearing away of the Earth's surface by the breakdown? Gab. Erosion. Let me continue with the question. Breakdown and transportation of rock and soil. The correct answer is erosion. Correct. Okay, check. Question number three. What is the English word for the fruit Filipinos call langka. Gab. Seb. Jackfruit. Jackfruit is correct. Okay, check. Question number four. In the Winnie the Pooh stories, what kind of animal is Eeyore? Gab. Donkey. Donkey is correct. Okay, check. Question number five. Weighing more than 300 times as the Earth, what is the most massive planet in the solar system? Seb. Jupiter. Jupiter is correct. Okay, check. Question number six. Describing which animal eats which, it is a linear network starting from producer... Allen. Food chain. Let me continue with the question. Starting from producer organisms such as grass and ending at an apex predator like a shark. What is this order of animals and plants called? The correct answer is food chain. Correct, paycheck. Question number seven, mental math. What number is one third of 45? Allen. 15. 15 is correct, paycheck. Question number eight. What grand sports event organized by the IOC and participated in by more than 200 countries is held every four years, just like in Tokyo in 2021. Gab. Olympics. Olympics or Olympic Games is correct. Okay, check. Question number nine. Although it lives in grassland like a savanna, 
What animal is known as the king of the jungle? Seb, lion. Lion is correct. Okay, check. Number 10. Spiders are usually predatory animals that have fangs and spin webs. How many legs does a spider have? Gab. It. It is correct. Okay, check. Thank you for the visual representation. Question number 11. Which senator is the host of the long-running public affairs radio program, Wanted Sa Radio? Alan? Senator Tulfo. Senator Tulfo or Rafi Tulfo is correct. Okay, check. Last question for this round, number 12. What is the name of the 8-foot-tall, yellow-feathered creature in the TV show Sesame Street? Alan? Big Bird. Big Bird is correct. Okay, check. And that's it for our first round. Recap tayo sa ating points. Allen is on the lead with 50 points, Gab at 40 points, Seb at 30 points, and Kim, pwede ka pa bumawi sa ating next round. Alright, ready na ba kayo sa round 2? Susunod na yan sa pagbabalik ng K-Check! Tuloy pa rin ang ating karunungan check. Recap muna tayo ng points. Nangunguna si Allen with 50 points, si Gab with 40 points, si Seb with 30 points, at si Kim babawi sa susunod na round. Now on to round 2. Contestants, get ready to buzz in but make sure you strategize. Correct answers are worth 20 points each but you lose 10 points if you answer incorrectly. Let's begin. Question number one. In anatomy, how many chambers are there in the human heart? Gab. Two. Two is malik. Set. Four. Four is correct. We check. Number two. The opera, The Marriage of Figaro, was composed in 1786 by which famous Austrian? Gab. Mozart. Mozart or Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart is correct. Okay, check. Question number three. What is the name of the pirate character played by Johnny Depp? Gab? Jack Sparrow. Okay, let me continue. Johnny Depp in the Pirates of the Caribbean series, Jack Sparrow is correct. Okay, check. Question number four. The third volume of what film franchise starring Zoe Saldana Chris Pratt and Dave Bautista was released in 2023. Gap. Guardians of the Galaxy. Guardians of the Galaxy is correct. Okay, check. Question number five. In golf, what is a special flat face club used to strike and roll the ball into the hole? The answer is Potter. Question number six, in biology. What do you call a group of organisms of the same species living in a specific geographical area, just like people in a certain city? Alan. Population. Population is correct. Okay, check. Question number seven. This is a problem in geometry. If the radius of a circle is 10 centimeters, what is its diameter in centimeters? Allen. 20 centimeters. 20 is correct. Okay, check. Number 8. The colors of the rings of the Olympic flag are taken from the flags of its member nations. How many rings does the Olympic flag have? Gab. 5. 5 is correct. Okay, check. Question number 9. To which of the three major island groups in the Philippines do Palawan, Romblon, and Masbate belong? Gab. Luzon. Luzon is correct. Okay, check. Question number 10. After overtaking China in 2023, what is now the most populous country in the world? Allen. India. India is correct. Okay, check. Question number 11. Who became the first emperor of the Roman Empire in 27 BC? Kim. Alexander the Great. Alexander the Great is Malay. Okay. 
Okay? The correct answer is Augustus Caesar. Last question for this round. What do you call the climactic event that generally occurs every 4 to 12 years in which warming of the ocean surface of the western coast of South America disrupts the normal pattern of the upwelling of cold, nutrient-rich water? The correct answer is El Nino Phenomenon. Okay, we end the second round. Uh, recap. Leading is Gab with 130 points, followed by Allen with 110 points, then Seb with 50 points, and Kim, negative 10, but pwede pang bumawi sa susunod na round. Dahil hindi pa tapos ang laban, ultimate pagalingan na sa pagbabalik ng K-Check. To K check. Rika po tayo sa mga points. Gab is leading with 130 points. Allen with 110 points. Seb with 50 points. And Kim with negative 10 points. Na pwede pang bumawi sa ating next round. So, sabulan na natin ang ultimate pagalingan round. Dito, correct answers are worth 30 points each. At my 15-point deduction for wrong answers. At sa ating panel of experts nga, manggagaling ang mga katanungan para mas exciting. Prof, let's go. Okay, ready na. Which of the following brands of air conditioners was named after the inventor of modern air conditioning? A. Kelvinator B. Condura, C. Carrier, D. Colleen, or E. Fujidenzo. Gab. Letter A. Calvinator. Mali. Although before the 1900s, madami ng cold air machine or cooling machines, it wasn't until 1902 that the history of air conditioning really began. A young engineer named Willis Carrier was tasked with the chore of creating a system for cooling the air. The correct answer is C. Carrier. The United States bought Alaska from which country? A. Canada. Allen. Russia. Binili ng Estados Unidos ang Alaska mula sa bansang ito sa halagang $7.2 million noong 1867. Ang tamang sagot ay letter D, Russia, K-Check. Prof. DG. Who is the actress who won the Best Actress Award in the 2019 Metro Manila Film Festival for her role in the movie Mindanao. A, Angel Aquino. B, Judy Ann Santos. C, Jacqueline Jose. D, Dolly De Leon. E, Gina Alham. Allen. Judy Ann Santos. She is a Muslim mother in this film who cares for her daughter afflicted with cancer. Her husband is a combat medic in the Philippine Army deployed to fight rebel forces in Mindanao. The answer is Judian Santos. Okay, check. Go ahead. Logic naman. Okay, logic. Logical ba kayo? Which of the following statements is equivalent to if it is a dog, then it's a mammal? A. If it is a mammal, then it's a dog. B, if it's not a dog, then it's not a mammal. C, if it's not a mammal, then it's not a dog. D, 
it is a mammal only if it is a dog or E all of the above Seb, letter C if it's a yan yan <laughs> if it's not if it's sipo. C. If it's not a mammal. Okay, then. so ating statement is kung dog siya, then mammal. So kung hindi siya mammal, hindi siya pwedeng maging dog. So the correct answer is C. If it's not a mammal, then it's not a dog. Okay, check. That's a very difficult one. <laughs> Sir Neil. What is the collective term of the indigenous peoples found on the island of... Gab. Indoro. A. Alangan. B. Aita. C. Hanuno. D. Mangyan. E. Tagbanwa. Alin. Mangyan. Okay. May walong pamayanang etniko sa Mindoro. Alangan, Bangon, Buhid, Hanunoo, Iraya, Ratagbitan, Tadyawan, at Taubuhi. Ang kolektibong tawag sa walong grupo na ito ay ang hinahanap natin na sagot sa aking tanong. Ang tamang sagot ay letter D, Mangyan, Paycheck. Thank you. Prof. Gigi. Ano ang samahan ng mga critics, writers, and scholars ng pelikula na tinatag noong taong 1977 na nagbibigay ng gawadurian. A. FAMAS B. MPP C. LUNA D. STAR E. THE EDDY Gab, letter A. Mali. Ang ibig sabihin ng MPP ay manonuri ng pelikulang Pilipino na nagbibigay ng gawad orian. Ang sagot sa ating tanong ay MPP. Diamonds are the hardest materials on the most scale. What is the softest material on that scale? A. Alin. Talk. Okay, the most hardness scale is used as a convenient way to help identify minerals and the hardness of materials. Ang pinakamatigas nga ay diamond with a scale of 10 and the softest is talc with a start with a value of 1. Okay, check. What was the role played by an umalohokan? in a community. A, advisor to a chieftain. B, community judge. C, public announcer. Yeah. C, public announcer. Town crier ang isa ring tawag sa nabanggit na posisyon. Ang tamang sagot ay C, public announcer, K-check. Prof. Gigi. What art form was born because of the collapse during World War I of social and moral values, and most call it an anti-art movement. A, surrealism. B, imp A, surrealism. Mali. Ituloy ko ang ano, okay. Surrealism, A, B, impressionism. C, expressionism. D. Dadaism E. Of Art Seb, C. Expressionism Mali Gab, you cannot answer anymore. Yeah, hindi na pwede. Alin? Dadaism This is a movement that rejected traditional artistic conventions and sought to challenge and disrupt societal norms. Infamously called the anti-art movement purposely to make art that would shock, confuse, outrage people, nonsensical, absurd, anti-establishment. 
Like, for example, yung French artist natin, si Michel Duchamp. The fountain, ilagay niya sa museum, ay yung fountain urinal. So, ganun po ang ating answer ay dadaisem. Okay, check. Thank you. Now, off to our last round. Prof. Marian. For the last question, our favorite subject, di ba? Which of the following numbers is divisible by three? A, 643, B, 543, C, 443, D, 343, and E, 143. Alan, 543. Okay, a number is divisible by 3 if the sum of its digit will be divisible by 3. So, 543 is correct. Okay, check. Titingnan natin, last two questions. Kung merong aabot for the first time sa 300 points. Tingnan natin. Prof. Neil. What is the oldest mall in the Philippines that still exists today? A. Ali Mall, B. Glorieta, C. Harrison Plaza, D. SM North Edsa, E. SM Mega Mall. Gab. Letter C. Harrison Plaza. Bali. Binuksan ang mall na ito sa publiko noong June 30, 1976. Ipinangalan nito kay Muhammad Ali na nanalo sa Thrilla in Manila noong 1975. Ang tamang sagot ay letter A, Ali Mall. Thank you so much. Last question, Prof. Gigi. Which of the following are considered as secondary colors? A, green, orange, and purple. B, red, pink, and blue. C, yellow, white, and red. Yung D, black, blue, and red. E, red, blue, and yellow. Gab, letter A. Secondary colors are created by mixing primary colors. Alam naman natin ang primary colors, red, blue, and yellow. So tama ka, yun ang sagot. Letter A, green, orange, and purple. Okay, check. All right, thank you so much. And that's it for K-Check Ultimate Pagalingan. Congratulations to Allen, our K-Check Weekly winner with a final score of 290 points. Congratulations. Thank you. 10 points na lang sana. Ikaw na ang, ano natin, kumbaga record-breaking, ano. Uh, dito sa show. So, subukan natin siguro sa finals. Try natin yan. Okay? So, makikita natin si Allen sa semi-finals when they compete with your other weekly winners. And of course, thank you to Gab, to Kim, and to Seb. Congratulations sa mga daily winners din naman kayo. And of course, maraming salamat po sa ating panel experts, Professor Marian, Professor Neil, and Professor Gigi. Ako po si Jules Giang. Join us again on Monday for another K-Check!